Traditional bathhouses are making a comeback, thanks to the youth-driven revival of Showa-era nostalgia. The Showa era corresponds to the years 1926 to 1989. If you've already indulged in the delights of an onsen, but have yet to experience a sento, now could be the perfect time to delve into the deeper layers of Japanese culture. In this video, I'll be showing you the basics of how to enjoy a sento. Today we're at Matsuba Yokujo in Yurigaoka, a sento that has been operating since 1961. The owners, Mr. and Mrs. Ishizuka, have kindly let us film on their day off. As you walk into the sento, you'll find shoe lockers near the entrance. Remove your shoes and put them in. And remember to take the key with you. Pay the fee at the counter. Most traditional sentos only accept cash. Changing rooms may not have signs in English, so it would be helpful to remember the Japanese characters for man and woman. Choose a locker to store your belongings. Some sentos require a 100 yen coin, which is returned to you when you unlock your locker. Take off your clothes and bring only a small towel and your toiletries. Choose a shower and put your toiletries on the rack. Grab a stool. Make sure you wash thoroughly before going into the baths. Once you're done, go ahead and choose your bath. Just be careful of the denkiburo or electric bath. The currents cause a tingling sensation, which many find relaxing, but it might surprise you if you're not used to it. Before you go into a bath, take a cup full of bath water, either with your hand or bucket. Pour it on your legs so your body can adjust the heat. Also, long hair should be tied up so it doesn't fall into the bath. It's finally time to soak in and enjoy. The bathing area often has a mural depicting Mount Fuji or some other scene from nature. Some bathhouses offer saunas, but these typically incur an extra charge. This one's pretty spacey. And you can also watch TV in here. Many sentos also provide drinking water near the entrance of the bathing area. You might also come across cold water baths, which are best enjoyed after a long soak in a hot bath or even following a sauna session. Here's a quick tour of the men's bathing space which is a bit bigger than the women's because more men used the sento in the Showa era. After thoroughly enjoying your time in the bath, take a rinse in the shower area. When you're done, remember to also rinse the stool and put it back where it was. Make sure to dry yourself before stepping out to the changing room. Retrieve your items from the locker and get dressed. Take a look at these machines oozing with nostalgia. This one here is probably a massage chair. This one looks like a heavy duty hair dryer. I usually bring my own toiletries, but at the Sento, you can also purchase soap and shampoo if you need them. And don't miss out on the selection of refreshing drinks you can buy after your bath. We hope you've had a wonderful time experiencing Japan's Sento culture. Thanks for watching till the end, and be sure to subscribe for more exciting content.